Hi there, Neil from Richter and welcome to another video. Today we're going to take a look at the brand new Halo 11 by Alpine. Uh, it's a brand new head unit. We've got it fitted to this VW T6.1. Uh, cracking, cracking install. So um, the Halo range, are it's almost like a Mercedes style tablet screen. And if you've got something like a composition media in these T6.1s, which is very basic, it's ideal. So you do a Halo 9, which has got a nine inch screen. This is the gigantic Halo 11, which has got the full 11 inch touch screen. Um, the key features of this install is um, we've retained all of the factory features. So um, yeah, we can talk through that. You've got the, the most important one is SOS retention. So because the original head unit's got emergency dialing, uh, if there's an accident, a lot of people fitting these units um, don't integrate that feature. So you, you, you can get a warning light on or it will just be disabled. All of that's working. We've got all of the car information. So if I'm pressing things like heated seats on this van, it's then coming up within the display. We've got the parking sensor retention, so front and rear optical park is retained. We've also got the factory reverse camera. Uh, the tailgate's up at the minute, but uh, it just gives you an example of that. So uh, we've got that. And the other big feature is the steering control. So as you come onto here, you've got volume within the steering wheel, which brings all that through. So um, yeah, I think it's, it's taken a little while to develop properly but now we've got the the relevant can interfaces and modules um it's really you know quite a nice install because you've got all of those original factory features retained into this lovely head unit it's full wireless carplay so if we go in to the menu we can come up in the carplay that's actually in the phone menu at the minute so you can then do missed calls receive call dials and dialed numbers make a call through there you've got all of your usual um apple carplay features basically so in this one we're using, um, for example, Google Maps, showing the location there in Milton Keynes. The other one I use a lot uh, on Apple CarPlay is Waze because it's giving you all of the live tra traffic information and also details on cameras and that sort of thing. So yeah, absolutely great install. For this particular one, we've got an extra piece here. Um, this is a Bluetooth volume control. So, um, you know, in a transporter, it's a five seat vehicle. Um, we don't know where we're going to mount it yet exactly, but somewhere in the back of the vehicle, we can mount this. It's completely Bluetooth. You can put it anywhere in the van. And that allows, for example, the children in the back to raise and lower the volume of the head unit. So it's just another nice feature. You know, maybe if it's a camper or something, you can put that in the sort of area towards the back of the van, allowing you to control the volume without moving forwards. Um, on top of that, it's combined with our uh, audio pack three so the the audison audio pack three we've got the plush uh, rear speaker pods in here as well we've got a subwoofer we've got an amp under the seat uh, i've had an additional power inverter for the customer so overall an amazing sounding system and uh, yeah really impressed so they're they're literally available to order now if you like that sort of thing um, give the team a shout on the phone and uh, we can get you a quote across and um, look to get that installed so hopefully that's been an interesting video and we'll catch up in the next video